Hey guys, good afternoon. This is Jeb Smith, Coldwell Banker Residential Brokerage in Huntington Beach. And today I'm back talking about the best time to buy a house. Uh, comes up a lot in talking to, to buyers um, that are just you know entering the housing market, even people that have owned a house for some time, maybe looking to sell, just trying to find out when the best time to actually purchase a home is. And, and honestly, there's not really a straightforward answer, as you might imagine, when, when asking that question. Uh, and, and the easy answer to it is that you know the best time to buy is when you find the right house. Um, clearly, you've you've already been through the pre-approval process, so you have an idea of what your payments are going to be, and you're comfortable with the price on that property. Um, at the end of the day, you know it's not really as much about being comfortable with the price of the property as it is being comfortable with the monthly payments of the property. So. You know, the easy answer is when it's right for you um, or when you find the perfect home, right? Uh, but historically speaking, if we, if we talk about just the market in general, you know, the springtime is usually the best time of uh, the year to, to list a house for sale. Um, and that's traditionally because there's more buyers in that time of the market looking um, if you look at it from a historical perspective historical perspective and, and you look at you know trends if you will so the springtime is usually the best time to list a house for sale and most of those houses go um, into escrow in April May and June which means they close during you know June July August um, and then the best time to buy a house is you know it's again, it's all relative, but the, the, the most number of transactions closed during the summer. Um, and that is because a lot of them went into escrow during that, that, that April, May, June timeframe that, that I mentioned earlier. And so they're closing during the summer. So the summer gets a lot of the credit for, you know, the best time to buy a house. But honestly speaking, you know, if you look at the trends, the best time to buy is probably towards the end of the year if the right property presents itself. And the reason for that is because you have less demand out there, less buyers looking traditionally. Uh, and then you also have, you know, people that if their home is on the market during the holiday season, during the holiday market, you know, the Thanksgiving, between Halloween and Christmas or the, the end of the year, those people are traditionally people that, that need to sell, that really want to sell their home. Otherwise, they wouldn't have people coming in their house during, during that time of the year. And so as a buyer, you know, if, if you've been through the pre-approval process, the right home presents itself during that time of the year, that's a really good time to quote unquote, get a deal on a property because you know that's traditionally when people are looking to you know they want to close it by the end of the year they're looking to to get out of that property so you know if I were a buyer and I had the opportunity to say purchase at the end of the year at the beginning of the year I would probably pick towards the the latter part of the year for those reasons but you know it, again as I mentioned it's relative it really comes down to you know what uh, you know what's causing you to move why you're looking to move you know time frames etc so you know when the right house presents itself you're comfortable with the monthly payment that is honestly the best time to buy but if you are a person looking for a deal traditionally speaking i would i would move towards the latter part of the year for for those reasons so i hope that's helpful i mean if you do have questions about the process um, you're looking to buy or sell a property feel free to reach out to me would love the opportunity to help um, you know all real estate is local, so it may be different in different markets. But and this year may be a little bit different for our market as well because buyer demand is still pretty high. Uh, you know, there's not a lot of property on the market. You know, our inventory is somewhat stabilized, but it's still lower than it has been. Um, so this year may be a little bit different. I mean, that the market may not soften as much as we we expect it to during this time of the year. Uh, but from a hus historical perspective, you know, th this is the best. Or, well, not right now, but we're moving into the best time of the year to uh, to. to buy a house and actually get a deal on it. So again, I appreciate you taking the time to watch. If you got it, you know, this far, do me a favor, like uh, the video, comment on the video, subscribe to my channel, would, would greatly appreciate it. And uh, we'll talk again soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.